you know, I come into these workouts thinking like, oh, you know, this is, shouldn't be that bad, should be pretty chill. What's up, team? Welcome back to another TB Fit Vlog. We got another good one here for you today, so let's head downstairs and get in this workout. Three, two, one. Let's get it. All right, you guys, we are starting this workout. So we got single leg uh, chest passes to the wall, like they're wall balls with a chest pass, okay? So grab it, you gotta catch it quick and you gotta push hard so, you, so it doesn't fall on you. Okay, so drive it at the wall, catch it, bring it back with a strong, with a strong uh, kind of pull back, right? So pull all the way back to your chest and use that, use that as explosiveness to press it. Like absorb slow, drive fast, absorb, push, absorb, Good, using your leg strength and that uh, that negative portion to help give you explosiveness on the chest pass. Keep the foot off the ground. One foot down, one foot up. We're going to our kettlebells. So, first exercise, we're gonna grab a heavy, heavy, heavy kettlebell, okay? So, whatever heavy means for you, that's what you're grabbing, okay? Grab it, hold it tight, shoulders back, eyes up, march it out, and I just go down and back a couple times. If you guys, you know, maybe have like a 30 to 50 meter distance that you can walk, perfect. But I didn't have a lot of space, so I'm just kind of going back and forth making a couple trips. But you know, just same thing as I say with weight, guys. Like, go the push yourself on the distance that you're walking. If you can't walk, you know, as far as I'm walking, cool, that's fine. Drop it a little bit, drop the distance, go as far as you can, right? So if you want to, you want to get to the point where you feel like, okay, this weight is may possibly drop. Get to that point. Don't just put it down. Uh, and when you're at a comfortable point during the exercise, like push yourself. That's how you get results. That's how you maximize the workouts that you're doing in the gym. Be honest with yourself. Be honest with your workouts. Give 100%. Give 110%. Yes, walk it out, walk it out. One side is gonna be harder. That's okay. Unless you were, uh, you can do things well with both hands. What's the term? Am ambidextrous, or probably not pronouncing that right. Right, but uh, unless you're that, uh, one side is gonna be in balance. So on that weak side, I still want you to push. I still want you to crush it. Next thing up, shake out your hands, cause I know your fingers are feeling it. Press your weight up to the sky. And be smart, guys. I wear all these things on my wrist. Like, if you're gonna wear that stuff on your wrist, the kettlebells gonna like smash into it and kind of hurt your your wrist if it's pressing into your into your skin. So, don't wear watches. Don't wear hard bracelets. It's, it makes it annoying. Press that weight up overhead. Punch it all the way to the sky. Armpit to ears. That weight should be straight up overhead. I should be doing better at this, guys. My arm should be a little bit more. Man, locked out. I'm looking at this and I'm just like, ah, do better. Do better, T. It's okay. Taking notes. I'll do better next time when I do this exercise, guys. So make sure that arm is locked out. Make sure you're punching that armpit to your ears. Make sure the whole time it's lifted. You're reaching, you're pushing the whole time and you're not just relaxing. This side's a little better for me. Doing a little bit better on my left. I'm a little bit more bouncier on my left though. But my range of motion guys on my left side, it tends to be better. Like flexibility, mobility wise, like I just, I'm able to move better with my left uh, upper, upper side. My right side is more stiff and more strong. All 
All right, you guys, that was a killer today. As always, I'm humbled by all these movements. You know, I come into these workouts thinking like, oh, uh, you know, this is, shouldn't be that bad, should be pretty chill. Nah, it's never chill. It's always hard work every time I step into the gym. Why? Because I'm intentional, I'm focused, and I'm doing it every every exercise, every rep, I really try to do it 110% uh, form-wise. And that creates a more difficult workout, I'm telling you right now. So try that out. Comment below. Let me know how you guys feel about that. But that's all I got for you guys today. Um, if you haven't seen my last workout, definitely check that out at the link over here-ish. Okay, check that link out for the last workout. All right, and just let me know how you guys are doing. Hang in there, keep it up, stay awesome.